one of the oldest buildings on Hilton Head Island, might not stand for much longer. It's a church right next to the island's airport, and it's located inside what's called a runway protection zone. As our Tyler Mannion reports, a relocation for the church is on the way, but how it is going to happen is still being debated. St. James Baptist Church has been here for 137 years. This is our choir area. Bringing people together on Beach City Road through worship and music for generations. Back in 1967, the airport opened up next door. And eight years later, the church's leaders tell me their new neighbor gave them a scare. The plane ascended from the airport from the runway, which is on the other side of these trees here. He says a crash happened right in their backyard, but church leaders in the 70s refused to move. That changed in the last decade, though. The congregation keeps asking us, when are we moving since we made the decision five years ago? Ford tells me they changed their mind when larger planes started coming to the airport. The church made a decision for safety reasons that it was best for us to move to a new location outside of the runway protection zone. Since that decision, there's been no relocation, as planes continue to fly a few hundred feet overhead. Looking to take action, the church's trustees have a plan. We hope that when we move to the new location that we'll be able to accommodate at least 250 to 300 people. That'd be an increased capacity of about 100 folks. They also want the historic school across the street relocated with them. We had estimated that cost about two years ago to be about $5 million. To fund the project, they need help. And that's what is causing the several year long delay. The FAA has to approve reimbursement for the project before work can begin. Beaufort County tells me the federal agency rejected their initial proposal. We want to make sure that what we submit and what we move forward gets the full 90% reimbursement that's allowed. He's trying to schedule a face-to-face -face meeting with the FAA, church, and county to iron out those details, leaving the situation unresolved until that meeting can get on the books. Reporting from Hilton Head, Tyler Mann, WTOC News. A heated